Alright, looks like Dark finally has a new skill he can use, which is fucking awesome. Cures almost all abnormal statuses. I'm kind of tempted not to fucking buy that, though. I don't know that that's very important right now, and I might want to save up for something better. So, we're not going to use that. We did get hit by another battle on the way to Gorma's house. So, we're gonna have to fight these bastards. Fingers crossed, it's the mushroom penises. Ah, oh, fuck. It's not the mushroom penises, it's the fucking sperm. Red my enemies on blades in the wind. Wind slasher. Wind slasher. Destroyed. You were slaughtered. Fucking. Which path should I walk? Well, hmm. This is a tough decision. Walk towards bad guys or get treasure. I'll hang on to this. Hell yeah. Red my enemies on blades of the wind. I still can't believe that Delma died last time. Wind slasher! I was trying to help her out, but you can only do so much, you know. I want that gold, so I'm just gonna Which path should I walk? Can I use this? Uh yes. Dark. You can use that. Die. It's called gold. Getting away with murder. Now we gotta go deal with my stupid ass cunt. I mean, lovely female friend who raised me. No. A filthy ass fucking whore with a loose ass vagina who didn't even birth me and treats me like a slave. You're late, idiot! I see you've got cheeky enough to think you can make me wait all day, eh? Uh, she's gonna be really pissed when I don't bring her herbals. YOLO. I mean, how late can you get? I could get later than this, bitch. What's this? Where are the verbals? I ate them all. You did catch some furballs, didn't you? You must be kidding! No way are you moronic enough to come back empty handed! Yeah, that was kind of stupid dark. We should have just fucking left. Well? Where are they? Up my ass. Tell me! There weren't any furballs. I didn't hear you. Say that again. She's gonna hurt him for this. And I mean, what if there weren't any furballs? It's not like it's his fucking fault. I said there weren't any furballs. Save the jokes for later. You worthless piece of demos wanna be scum? Man, I fucking hate Guido. I bet you didn't even search properly. Then go do it yourself, you fat ass bitch. You just went off and had a grand old time, didn't you? Oh yes. Yes, it was fucking grand. Because it's it's always fun getting choked to death by your mom. Good for nothing? Trash! Imbecile! Blockhead! Oh, now you've gone too fucking far. Trash and imbecile I can handle, but blockhead? Moron! You still don't understand what happens when you make me angry? Well, I guess I'll have to teach you and teach you well. It's time you learn once and for all what happens when you don't do as you're told. Oh yes, I'll etch that lesson into the very marrow of your bones. Guido is fucked up. This is dark as shit. It really is. 
It's such an interesting concept. This entire game is beautiful. I, again, recommend it for anybody that likes these kinds of games. It's just really fucking fun. The story is beautiful and the characters are so interesting. You waste of skin? Just one or two furballs! Why couldn't you have caught at least that many? I didn't raise you to play around all day or to go on a leisurely stroll, got it? How about if you try coming in handy once in a while, eh? Ugh! Felt that one, eh? Down to your bones. This is what happens when you disobey me? Fucking cunt. And, and you think that this is the worst that Guido gets. But you'd be wrong. Save the day, Mos. Father! Dark, listen well. A crisis is drawing near. The destruction of all Deimos. Fuck, the destruction of all Deimos. I, I, I don't think Dark really has that much sympathy for their kind right now. But since your dad is telling you, if things go on like this, the Deimos will be destroyed. Since he's telling him to save them, they, they matter, but they're kind of fucking dicks to him. All Deimos. All will feel pain, suffering, and will breathe their last. Dark, my son, the child of a Deimos and a human. You can surely escape the fate of the Deimos. The power to change their destiny of destruction. Uh-oh. Lies within you. Pops, that's a lot of fucking pressure to put on my shoulders. I am literally a slave. I can't even leave the house for like five minutes without getting in trouble. The fuck am I supposed to save an entire race? Dark. Save the Deimos from ruin. You can do it. Okay, Dad. If you say so. Dark. Save the Father! A dream? Save the demos, eh? Heh, <laughs> heh. <laughs> Doesn't it make you laugh, damn it? Yeah, it kinda does. I see where you're coming from. You're kind of a slave and you have no control and no power and all the demos are dick bags so yeah it is kind of funny I can do it he says what can I do me ha I'm Guido's slave man this is making my voice my throat hurt even when I was fighting that track here I don't know what would have happened if Delma hadn't been there dark dark <laughs> Come on. <laughs> what would have happened if Delma had been there? Really? She died almost instantly. We tried to cure her. She was mostly a waste of space. We were a higher level and we killed everyone. She was not a help. And I can save the Deimos? Ridiculous. I... I can't do a thing. My poor child. You can. Dark, you can, but first we have to kill Guido, okay? I don't think Dark has it in himself to kill Guido, at least not at this point in the story. Maybe after her later, later endeavors, you know. No spoilers. Oh shit, where's that ugly fuck? Huh? Guido's not here. My throat really is starting to hurt. That's strange. She hardly ever goes out. Says it's just too much trouble. I know. I'll go see how the Furble's doing. I'm a little worried that Delma might have said something to Denzel. some help. Let's check if we can get into this now that she's not here. It won't open. Guido still has it sealed with her magic. Damn it, Guido, you little cunt. 
Well, you aren't little. You are not little. You are... Oh, shit. Sup, Delm? Jeez. She really did a number on you. It's nothing new. What do you want? Nothing in particular. Oh. You just stopping by for a little visit? You want to hop on my cock? Come on. Let's go. Guido's not home. We have the house to ourselves. Or whatever you want to call this thing that we live in. I thought you might have been killed by the Drake year, but Delma, Delma, you were killed by the Drake year. Oh, oh, she doesn't remember because, you know, this happens when ghosts cross over. It's a process where they, they forget that they died. So she clearly, she's just clearly in denial of her own demise. I just came to see your ugly mug. Oh, my ship! You fucking adorable fucks. She knows he ain't ugly. She knows he's sexy as fuck. She wants to... She wants to do things to him. Because I want to do things to him. Yeah? Sorry to worry you. Look, I wasn't worried. Where are you going? You're not my keeper. Do I have to tell you? Uh... Of course not. But it's not safe to wander around too much. Oh, Those damn Drakiar. You never know where... You never know. They might still be after your windstone, right? Well, they probably are. I doubt because we killed a couple of them that they don't want their most precious thing in the entire universe. I'm worried that you might have told Densimo about the verbal. What? Wait, where are you going? Mind your own business. I'm like fucking Batman voice. My throat is really getting dark, dark. You need to, you need to quit smoking. I didn't tell my brother, all right? I made a promise, didn't I? A promise. Oh, these fucking, they're so fucking cute. I can't deal with it. It's not often a Deimos keeps her promises. Oh, shut up. I just felt like it. <laughs> She's like, it was my choice. I kept my promise because I wanted to. It has nothing to do with caring about you. Except it obviously does. I don't know where you're going, but I'm coming with you. Yeah, you will be coming with me. You will. Don't get the wrong idea. Oh. Damn, I feel like she just put me in my fucking place. <sighs> I just want to kill some Drak here. They have to be punished for invading our territory. And and if I'm with you, they might show up. So the way she did her little shy fucking kick. Okay. You want the D. You want the D. The dark. And the dick. Whatever. Now he sounds like fucking Squall. Whatever. Whatever. Dot dot dot. Whatever. Where am I going? Checking on the furball? Let's go check on that fucking furball. The adorablest furball in the entire world. I'm scared. Oh. Look, you can already see over there. See all those little cute furball eggs? How could an egg be cute, Tracy? Hey, the screen's not fucked up this time. Good. You've come here for the furble again, haven't you? You sure are crazy about those things. <laughs> yeah, well, they are fucking adorable. It's not that. I am of the wind. A new era. What was that? I heard some kind of strange voice. It couldn't be. The stone? Hey, Dark. What's with that pile of rocks there? This? 
This is my father's grave. This? My father died here. You definitely don't act much like a Deimos, do you? Because Deimos, I don't... I believe Deimos don't bury their dead or anything. They just... They just don't care whenever people die. Which is pretty, you know, callous and heartless. It's a very human thing to do. Burying your, your dead and keeping a grave. You never quit. I'm telling you, I'm... Look, Deimos don't build tombs, that's all. There's no denying it's sad when your friends and family die. But the only ones who build tombs and sob their regrets over them are humans. That's such a- that's a really interesting concept. It's kind of... I mean, it's a testament to how more, like, animalistic Deimos are to humans. Or why humans have that special humanity that makes them do that. Or maybe stupidity, I don't really know. My father was killed by Drakir. That's why. If you have time to build a tomb, you have time for revenge. See? And that's the place that it automatically goes to for her. She, for Deimos, it's like, let's not mourn, just kill who fucking did it. A fang for a fang, it's just common sense. An eye for an eye, a fang for a fang, that's just fucking cute. Da 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 da, you're really sounding like Squall now. Da, 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 da. Whatever. Ah, uh, what the heck? It's no skin off my back if a Deimos wants to build a tomb. Aww, she's just like, you do you. I still like you. I'm gonna go check on the furble. Oh! She's gonna check on the furble. You fucker, you cuties. Oh, damn, he's so sexy though. Hmm. Revenge, huh? But never mind that. What was that voice? It's almost as if Windolf's tomb is trying to tell me something. Yeah, why don't you look at the fucking... Look at the stone, you silly willy. How's the... Oh. How did he do that, though? He has no verbal mate. Did he just... Maybe she was already knocked up when we kidnapped her. Who knows? Eggs! Furble eggs! Yes, Doma. Yes. Man, do they look tasty. Uh-oh. What? Please, I was only kidding. I mean, they kind of do. They're, they look like eggs. Now, what is this? Such an odd feeling. Oh! I feel like my face is gonna split wide open. Oh my god, this is so fucking... This is beautiful. It's like something that had been strung taut has co just come loose. I... I'm not myself. Or something. This feeling's a first for me. Oh, this is... This is precious. This is called love, Delma. You're in love. You're in love. That would be happiness. Hap-pi-ness? The hell is that? <laughs> it's damn weird. I love Delma. I think all Demos should be feeling that way. I want to build them a peaceful world. Free of war and strife. I want to save the Deimos. Hmm. You really are strange, you know? I've never heard anyone say anything like that before. But, who knows? You just might be able to do it. I mean, you made her feel happiness. Eh? Delma, I didn't know you were Canadian. 